muchachos. Hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions, you idiots. This is part two of our Renbeer um, AIB podcast. If you haven't seen part one, that's already been up. You can go check that out right now. So we're just going to go ahead and start into it. Three, two, one. Press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update from All India Bakchod. 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 You were also supposed so to do the Kishore Kumar biopic. Is that happening? Kishore Kumar. Oh. It was happening, but uh, there's a sort that there's. One character's family or one person's mm. family didn't mm. allow us to use that person, oh. and that was the main uh, conflict of Kishore right, Kumar's right, right, right. life. Mm. Uh, so I hope it happens. You know, doing biopic is very tricky because even when you were doing the Sanjay Dutt biopic, there were mm. so many people's families who called "Hamare baare mein mat likhna," mm. you know, about his certain ex-girlfriend or certain yeah. wife. You can't use all that unless you have permission. permission yeah. So it's could tricky you, to make. Biopic. Could you try changing it like FIFA or Pro Evolution yeah. Soccer? Like Punjab Pat. The Yugoslavia. So we. Had to resort to that. Fina Funi, so you had to go, obviously. But yeah. Well, yeah. which actor have you met and that you immensely talk about that? Right? Which actor have you met that you've fanboyed immensely? Yeah, Dinero ke pair pe pada tha. What was that photo yeah. that you? Yeah, had? that was. Yeah. That was hamming the shit out of that. <laughs> my, favorite, my, <laughs> favorite, <laughs> yeah. my favorite picture but of that one is the Kunal Kohli. <laughs> what is that? What is that? अनुपम के स्कूल सो ये इन्वाइटेड फ्यू एक्टर्स एंड But to be honest, who wasn't like uh, I mean the embarrassing moments weren't photographed. Hmm. But who was as equally or more embarrassing than me was Anil Kapoor. Like yeah. you have no idea what <laughs> Anil Ankil was doing. Also, <laughs> Anil Ankil was pushing people and all. You know, like Varun is coming on, I'm coming, he's kicking and all. <laughs> and he's like steady like this. Jali photo kich, photo kich. <laughs> so like we, we all were like just at our worst. Yeah, but I. I and he was uh, he was actually feeling like that koala bear because yeah. he was wondering what is happening. Yeah. He wasn't saying anything. He didn't give a rat's ass who we were. Uh, you know, we were asking about taxi driver, uh, about you know these intelligent questions. Everyone had some trivia to you know <laughs> ask him about and all. And all he did was, hmm, and he just looked the other way. <laughs> all he did. So my impression of Robert De Niro is not so great anymore. But it's okay. If I'm a lungi dance, to correct lungi dance. Kevin, I'm not sure. End me. Our level pe le aaye. That's yeah, the yeah. purpose of IFA. Like I love IFA because I'm saying that who is a Hollywood actor who will reach level to get there. Zalil will do it. It's fun. We'll write one more and we'll put it on the side. Weird. Martin Scorsese calls him the best Manik Chand scene of the year. The Manik Chand scene of the year. Yes. You talking to me? Best Jody. सलमानियाल मीडिया With Sohail came to take yeah. good Salman like what social media? Do you give a shit about awards though? Is it like a thing like you want? I mean, I used to uh, I mean go crazy, you know, when I was winning Best Actor awards and all. It's kind of cool. Mm. Uh, but then when you stop winning, then you don't give a shit about it. Fair. When you're winning, you do give a shit about Fair. it, you know. What does that feel like though? Then because it sort of and again not to go back to the cliched questions like you said about. And you, you had your three four. If Rekha Ji calls you a day before. Yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> like isn't that isn't that a thing? See, the thing is like that day uh, when I was dressed as a girl uh -huh. when I won Critics Best Actor. Uh -huh. Uh, uh and then our act was over because the last four main awards was hosted by Karan Johar hmm. uh and so me and Shahrukh sir were backstage and i was getting ready to go back home because i thought chalo mera award ho gaya oh. they gave me critics best actor oh, yeah. uh so when they called me back and said no 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 you could be winning this award and all then that excitement was amazing you know hmm. to go back and also win the best popular actor award hmm. then next year when i won for barfi 
and when I got the award, which was at around 2:30 uh, yeah. at night, <laughs> there was nobody in the audience. <laughs> yeah. There were like five people sitting there. Yeah. You know, and then that really, you know, got to me like people don't really respect this. You know, mm. there is no kind of respectability. No, in I don't know if people don't respect or not, but I think there's a point at about 2:30 in the morning where people are, how much do I respect? That this? is. Yeah. Because <laughs> I, I'll still never forget that the one that you and Shahrukh hosted. And Javed Ankil and Shabana Aunty were abusing us on stage. Yeah, yeah. and I remember. Arre, hata ho in loko, uh, yaar. <laughs> Boni Kapoor came to give the last award, and I still remember. It's one of the most snarky things yeah, I've heard announcers yeah, yeah, yeah. say. He's like, good evening, but now you good morning. Bolna <laughs> <laughs> like, he just says this openly. And I'm like, ooh. Do you, you dance at award shows, no? You've done all that yeah. stuff. You, you I haven't danced in weddings, but I've danced in award shows. I enjoy hosting. Uh, because when you guys, when we work together, and I've only worked with you guys, uh, it's fun, you know? Then it's, 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 you're doing something, you know, you know it's, it's fun. But I think dancing is a little boring for me on award shows. Now in a new house, you moved out of yeah. the house finally. So, kya, ko, do you have the same problem as that you don't have Society yeah, my, no cook, my cook left Depo yesterday for a month. I don't have anybody to make a meal at night. So my mom is sending me dabba service <laughs> from her house. Uh, but it's great, you know, I have, I, have a good, uh, I have a good system at home. I have two people who work for me. I have two dogs, hmm. an English Mastiff, a French Mastiff. And it's like having two grandparents living at home. Hmm. Because it's a lot of work, hmm. you know, to take care of them. Uh, their walks, their food, they're always falling sick. I don't think it's the best breed to have in this country, yeah. but I got gifted mm. uh, the dogs, so I, have, I really have to take care of them. But it's great, yeah. You know, I do nothing. I made myself a nice cinema room. I'm mm. watching movies, I'm, I'm, I'm chilling. Um, people don't believe this about me, but 90% of time, I don't have a thought in my head. Mm. Like even when I'm sitting on set or I'm sitting at home, I, I, I'm a blank person. Uh, without that also. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so fucking juvenile of me, yeah. right? I'm so juvenile. <laughs> I was wondering who was going to do it. Yeah. You did not disappoint. In my yeah. head, I was like, yeah. yeah. Do you know yeah. how much yeah. trouble I fell into? Because in. I remember I did a GQ interview on my first day. Oh. And I spoke about like smoking pot in school. And you know, oh, yeah. I, was a, I was a big pot smoker. You got you in trouble? Know? Like lawyers were calling my dad and all. He can't speak like that in this country. Oh, no, no. And you know, he's going to go to jail. <laughs> hmm. So the lawyers then call you, ki kya baap kya tweet kar raha hai, tum dono kya karte ho yaar ghar mein. Na please papa ka phone le lo. Wow, my dad's tweets man. What do I say about it? Um, yeah, my mom. What is the answer that you've wrote now as yeah. part of the yeah, template? Of that. The template that you made on dad's tweets. There is a template, but let me not say the template. Huh. The thing is, what I feel about his tweets is that a he's extremely honest. He's yeah. exactly like you actually. Yeah. You know what you feel? There is always like some humor disguise, Correct. which is a bit. Layered, so people don't get it. Yeah. Uh, he's also very passionate about certain things like yeah. politics yeah. or like any thing, topical thing that's happening, and he says it. I, on the other hand, I'm 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 quite opposite of him. You know, I'm Correct. I'm quite a hypocrite. Mm. If they ask me to talk about any political thing mm. or anything controversial, I'll give the most hypocritical right. answer yeah, right. just to kind of just you know, yeah. it. well left kind of a way. Uh, so now. How do I criticize him for it? I mean, he falls into trouble. Yeah, it's like, yeah. he's right to say. Yeah, I mean, every you, you Punjabi uncle, it's so cool. It's yeah, every yeah. Punjabi uncle, yeah, yeah. 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 So my mom is giving him a hard time, hmm. you know, and really giving him a hard time. Like he really has to go and sleep in the sitting room, kind of a <laughs> hard time. Bottle nikal do na room se. He's all of that. He's going to fix this. Wo, wo, even without the bottle, also he's like this. You know, yeah, I mean, he's, he's actually very. But, he but Twitter's like that, right? Once you start, because I mean, I don't matter even if you're Rishi Kapoor. I'm guessing retweets are addictive. Yeah, yeah. It's still true. Retweets. It's, it's crazy. Have, you, have you been pitched any uh, web series type thingies? Because we're writing one for Amazon Prime. Slide that so in. It's a slide nice, slide uh, nice endorsement. Yeah. No, I've already asked him. He won't uh, do anything on the web, right? Damn now. it. Do three or flop. So, three. Do three or major. Do three or Besharam. Besharam two. No, Dutt gayi to me aa rao. Dutt gayi to me aa rao. Besharam two. Calcutta Velvet. Kolkata Velvet. Do you do you know how much like do you know how much money you have? No. You don't know how much. I money. have enough. I know I have enough for like <coughs> even if I have Kolkata Velvet or Besharam too, hmm. I'm fine. You You're know? okay. Yeah, I'm but, okay. But you don't look at your money. I don't. Uh, I, I I I'm not too fond of material things like earlier hmm. on to buy a sports car and all is great, but right now I don't care. You know I don't want a sports car. I don't want a plane. Um, you know, as long as I, I get mean, to you do have a football team, Ranbir. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> like your own football team. <laughs> call them and like it. Hello. I want to point out. Okay, two things here. Uh. Shahrukh not invited us to play FIFA. Yes. Ranbir never invited to football game. Football. <laughs> I'm sensing <laughs> a pattern, guys. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sensing a pattern. But you, but you guys never mentioned that I was there that day when you spoke about this FIFA thing, which 
Shansar. Yeah, yeah, you were there. You were there. You we were drinking in his there. house till seven in the morning when yes. we clicked that picture with Terminator. Yes, we did. With the, uh, with the Terminator, yeah. we did. And it was so much fun because those three nights we just sat and we heard his stories. Yeah. And I have to say, Ranbir becomes very subservient around. <laughs> oh, it was beautiful. It <laughs> was so like, like that was the ago. first time I saw that dynamic yeah. of senior star and junior, junior star. star. Because you see, Ranbir right now, like, oh guys, let's talk about masturbation. <laughs> this, that. When Shah Rukh is drinking, Ranbir little like, sir, drink, drink, sir, 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 drink, and he's messaging us after the Saru podcast. Oh, you guys were so nice to Saru. Yeah. Fuck, have you seen yourself around Saru? Yeah. It's like you forget you have a Kapoor surname. Yeah. I'll uh, put a question back to work. So, if you don't want to act in the web series, you want to produce with the money you have nah. for Amazon. Yeah. <laughs> just not my cup of tea, man. Okay. Yeah, but, seriously, tell me, what is the reach of web series? Though? Is it a platform which has been accepted in this country? I'll give you, I'll give you an example. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I this was many years ago. Yeah. Right? The average ticket price of a movie. It's 200 bucks. The average sketch does five, five to six million comfortably. Okay, and if it's a good series, it can go up to seven, eight million. Yeah. So a good show. Yeah. Can be as big as yeah. a 200 crore film. Yeah, but that usually doesn't happen. That's like saying that we have a billion people, so when like three percent go, you'll make so much of money. Huh? It, I, I don't think. Is there engagement like to In like fact, watch? the engagement is spectacular, right? Because it, uh, unlike yeah. film or whatever, it's such an interactive but platform. Then, but then, but then, okay, okay. So th this whole internet thing has boomed. In the last say three four years, but there is no big web series in our country right now, right? There Which is, is you going, you're yeah. unaware of it. it. So it is. It's <laughs> there. It's it's in the same way that like a Bollywood has its own audience. This also has Hindi its own audience. Hindi film industry. But yeah, <laughs> the Hindi film industry has its own audience. Uh, um, yeah, yeah. The Indian Hindi English web industry <laughs> 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 also has its own audience. Okay. See, I'll always be a. Uh, We're catching uh, them uh, young. I, yeah, I, yeah I'll, I'll always be uh, the hater of it because it's going to take away people from my theatre. You know stuff like stuff like this is because you're giving them entertainment at home, so that just doesn't give them a, an, uh, an, an, you know, something to go out and watch a movie. But I wonder the how movie watching works. experience is different. Movie, it is, yeah, I don't think it, it is. But then you but know, like when you, but, but when you film, make films like say a Tamasha or mm -hmm. or say, um, uh, it's not an event film, right? It's not the the big. Summer movie. It's not. It's it's not, not that but then, couldn't you, you argue that, that this stuff that also helps a movie like Tamasha or the non-event films by now these online platforms yeah. often give yeah. these films a second and a third and a fourth life. Maybe, and maybe, yeah. They do that, right? Especially Which is not I, happening earlier. I wonder what the data is on this. Like, but someone like say House of Cards. I'm sure it helps yeah. Kevin Spacey's movies and yeah. vice yeah. versa, something like that. So yeah. I'm sure there is some cross engagement. But maybe in a more yeah. developed. Well, listen, more if you guys are making a web series, it better be kick-ass, man. Because you know, you guys have the responsibility. No, no people pressure, follow no you. No, pressure, no, pressure. no, there is pressure, no man. This no is pressure, like no this is like Raju Virani and Amir Khan coming together. Speaking of pressure, you are making a fantasy film. Don't fuck it up. True. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. Okay, we don't get a lot of opportunities to make fantasy yeah. films in this country. Yeah. Um, and the the formula is all there. It's you. It's Ayan. Yeah. It's it all it. All right, let's do. Let's do more. Yeah. Uh, Ron, what was the Sanjeev Bansali thing that you were mentioning? Um. No, so that was the thing. You work with him a fair amount and yeah. he can be, I mean, difficult is the word that some people use, eccentric yeah. is the word that some people use. What is it like in that situation though? Do you just buckle down and go, okay, he's <laughs> a genius, I will go with it? Yeah. That's what or I did because I was an assistant on Black huh. and everything I knew about filmmaking or acting came from him. So he became my, my, my in the true sense, my godfather. You mm. know, I, sure. I followed him, I looked mm. up to him um, and when we were doing Sabarya, uh, like he was God for me, you know. He was mm -hmm. creating me, and uh, you know, so it was like God worship, mm -hmm. and uh, and he was playing God. Sure. You know, it was his assistant directors, these huge sets. It was Sanjeev Lal Bansali after Hamdul, Devdas, and Black. So mm -hmm. he was like the yeah, big he thing. Yeah, the guy. Uh, but, but but it was dark. You know, it was very dark. Uh, I mean, he really grinded us, and he really gave us a hard time. But that also kind of. I mean. I, c I come from a sheltered background. I've never been like abused or shouted at. Mm. And yep, he was abusing me. He was hitting me. He was like making me clean the floors. And mm. um, so I think that experience really uh, grounded me. It really taught me a lot. That brings me what? to another question. And I promise I'm not just saying this to be controversial or whatever. A larger philosophical question about filmmaking. Because Jennifer Lawrence said the same thing about David or Russell, yeah. where that directing ke naam pe thappad marta tha, this that, which yeah. brought me a philosophical question: is, Do we then use this concept of he's a genius or she's a genius to excuse? Not good behavior. No, no. Listen, like I In believe that humility is an artist's greatest virtue. Sure. So it's 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 something which I believe. That's of course was my first filmmaker. But if mm. I don't like a person, mm. if I believe that a person is not a good human being, I don't want to give myself to him. Sure. And especially mm. in the field of art, you know, because you have to kind of surrender and you have to give yourself. And I wouldn't want to work with someone who is not good. Not saying that Sanjeev Lal Bansali no, is that. Sure. But if I don't like a person, I don't want to work with him. Simple. Mm. 
you mentioned in Vogue, the one you yeah, you the you in mentioned in Vogue, and that's why I bring it up. Is and this is again because <coughs> considering you say you're super reticent, this is one of the most frank things I've ever heard yeah. an Indian actor talk about. Where you're like, you know what? Sometimes I think I have a drinking problem, and it just what happened like sort of in the after was that just like. I don't know. Was that the hangover talking? Was that is that something that you do? Really? No, no, no. Is I have a drinking yeah. problem because drinking is fun. Sure, of course. <laughs> of course. <laughs> you know? Which is why. No, exactly. Which is true. Yeah. Objectively true. And if you aren't working, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know, of course, yeah, I, I'm in a visual medium, so I have to look good. So right. I can't drink while I'm working. Mm -hmm. But uh, because of Jagga Jasus and the period it took, the time, there were a lot of free days. And yeah. in my free days, I realized because a, I'm a loner. Mm -hmm. I'm sitting at home. Yeah. I drink. Uh, oh. And then it hit me, okay, okay, listen, you know, I have a drinking problem in my family. So I can't, uh, I can't, I have to deal with it. Okay. Uh, yeah. Because you there's know? something very positive about that. Yeah. Because there's a lot of young people who are probably struggling yeah. with yeah. that and don't know that. And it's very refreshing to hear a successful person come out and go, these are my demons, mm. I have to deal with them. Yeah, you, know? you have to, I because honestly, like I'm seeing my, my in my own family, you know, there are so many pr health problems. Uh, so many things that they have to deal with because of drinking. Right. Uh, it's fun because you're young and you know it's fun to be high and and you know just relax and stuff. But eventually it's going to catch up, man. Sure. You yeah. know you're going to age faster. You're going to get like unhealthy. You're going to get fat. You're going to look bad. Uh, and it's good to like you know discover this very early in your life. Of course it yeah. is. So, so how do you pull yourself you know, back from that yeah. drink then? Uh, when I think because of the people I surround myself with. You know, okay. they I, like I said I don't have yes people. I have people who who tell me. You know. I, I, how it is? Kitna hai rivalry kitna hota hai industry mein? Rivalry? Rivalry hota hoga both. Like you look at like basically I push ki Ranveer jab kill karta hai gaan jalta hai ki nahi basically. Tu kabhi uska aisa tire cut kiya? Jaldi audition pass kar liye. Starting the crowd with the blade in my hand. Of course, you know jealousy is a very basic human emotion and and most so actors are insecure. Yeah. But having said that, when I see Ranveer in Bajirao Mastani. Mm. Or when I see Varun in Badrinath Ki Dulaniya. Mm. Or Sushant in Dhoni. Or, or mm. whatever performances stand out. Uh, you do feel a bit uh, jealous. Mm. Uh, but also you feel inspired. Then you like go back home. Ke kal toh main wala, you know, now I have to work harder. So I think in that sense the competition is, is, is a bit heated up. I don't wish him to do badly or somebody else to do badly. What is the most annoying thing a journalist has ever done? Given that we have couple in the room. Most right? annoying thing. Annoying thing. What is, what is this? They've written then? about you which pissed you off. No, so no, right. Or just the point at which you went, this crosses a line. I line, think the line. most annoying thing that any journalist can do is seem disinterested in your work. Hmm. You know, and who seem right. more interested in your personal life. Hmm. You know, when their tentacles stand up in answering the question of like, was it okay dealing with your breakup? Mm. As opposed to what your character is about, like mm. that pisses me off. It's, it's always fun when you do a podcast and it's front page Bombay Times, yeah. and I just may get messages from yeah. friends who are journalists saying, "Bencho, how the fuck did you <laughs> get this out of <laughs> this one? How did you get this story out?" Yeah. I, I don't know. They just want to yeah. be fun. I think what happens is when you, anyone around comedians feels like I should also be. Yeah, yeah. that's yeah. the problem. Yeah. That's the problem with coffee with Karan here yeah. because you know him so well, mm. and he makes you so comfortable. So when you're chatting with him, you don't realize there's a billion people who are taking <laughs> yeah. every word of yeah. yours so seriously yeah. that you're gonna get really, you know. I think about our it. first understanding of that was the roast. Yeah. I think yeah. where we realize that when you put a bunch of non-comedian room with comedians, yes. they will work extra hard oh. yeah, to like reach that this thing. And aren't, you, aren't you tired of coffee with Karan? I am. As I am. I was forced this season. I told him I don't want to come and me and Anushka actually were going to protest and get the entire film industry together because to stop this, it's not fair because he's making money out of us. Yeah. We come and we get screwed through the year. You know, and it's not right. It's not. What happens in the hamper? But nothing. Ganda, you get anything. Same iPhone. Joshi, Joshi, got a hamper. Oh yeah! One second, one second, one second, one second. One, one. 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 अच्छा एंड डी बेस्ट पार्ट उसके बाद मेरे दोस्त मेरे साइड पे लिया बोला तेरे को गरीब लोग का हैम्पर मिला तो सोच स्टार हैम्पर में क्या होगा बट यू वो तेरे को डेढ़ लाख का टॉयलेट टॉयलेट लगा हाँ वो भी मिला यार स्मार्ट टॉयलेट बट नहीं उसके पास होगा ऑलरेडी बट जो बट जोशी डेड वोट पे हैज बेस्ट रेस I am just like this thing like because it needs an electrical connection. I am like Bombay light गई तो मैं क्या करेगा? हाँ नहीं Bombay तो नहीं जाते नहीं नहीं नहीं. What is it? It's like a pot which is hot. No no it's got like seven buttons. You don't have to do anything. It's just buttons. You don't have to shit also. You can shit. That much you have to do. But then after that it takes care of. You push a button you can do like water temperature and shit. Oh. No that fuck is that like Japanese toilet. हाथ की ज़रूरत है? नहीं. Seriously? Seriously. So there's a hand which comes? Yeah literally. Like me as well. So clearly you didn't open your own hamper. I didn't get this. No we don't get this. I'll give you mine. So you guys are the poor people. Yeah. What are you getting? You will get something else. Nothing more. We get like. Got out. Sorry, we need a phone. 
Manju made agency. Fifa kunta la DC senior. Fifa Fifa khelta hai tu? Ha. Khele ya ke saath. See the Life thing is model. that you guys bully me and you guys will probably like force yourself to my place <laughs> and like I like cover it and put it on social media you uh, can't do that with Shahrukh Khan we have an we have an idea for this ISL promotion yeah season promotion let's wrap it up let's wrap it up let's wrap it up other people oh, I, <laughs> all right uh, thank you very much for doing this uh, ranbir uh, fifa FIFA very soon. Actual football team. Actual also football will team be nice. also will yeah. be nice. Are you guys good in FIFA? Or you're just no, saying no. FIFA. FIFA I'm half decent. Cool. We're okay. He's pretty good. I'm, I'm half decent. Well, okay. What, what, what team do you play with? Uh, Madrid. You? I play with Madrid. India. Patriotism. Today I'm a patriotism. Today patriotism is going on. Really? Yeah. Why not? You? United or Barca? You? United. Always you United. you are a fan of Barca. Barca. He's a Barca, you're a Barca, Barca, Barca boy. Barca. Yeah. You. Whoever. If the other team, the other guy picks Madrid, you pick Barca. Yeah. That's how it is. Pretty much the same. All right, thank you very much for doing this. Thanks. Uh, all the best for Jagar Jasoos and see you guys next time. I will tell you what. Um, Rick, are you there? Rick? I am. I'm here. Oh, you're frozen. I'm here. Hello. Hold on. Hold on. Can you hear me? I can. I think you're frozen, though. Hold on. Okay. You're good now. Yeah, you're all. We're good now. You're all kind okay. of. I can hear you though, so I think you're fine. Yeah, well, that obviously that was fine. Okay. Obviously, it was a, just a, a comedy podcast that really made me want to actually just talk to him because he seems to want to talk about the craft. <laughs> Is, that, is what he is yeah, like. I, I he, was, he's like begging to talk about the craft, and so Ren Beer, if you are watching, please come on our channel. Obviously, I know AIB. They're yeah. they're comedy. That's what they do. That's whatever. They they're there to be funny and and all that kind of stuff, and that's their thing. If you want to talk about craft, just come on the channel, man. We would love to talk to you for an hour just about process okay. and acting and yeah. uh, all that kind of stuff. Yeah, and if there's any stupid babies writing in the comments of here, you know what's wrong with Rick today? There's nothing wrong with me, and I, I mean no offense by this, but I was I was mostly bored throughout the interview. Yeah, obviously that was mostly just um, a, a lot of fun, kind of just nothingness. Uh, obviously, uh, is what they were talking about. There were some interesting points though, yeah. like oh, it, which was really interesting when he was talking about Sanjali Bansali, which was I didn't know he was like this this guy that was known like. I guess Quentin's kind of known as that kind of guy too, right? He's kind of known as like a, he's pretty intense on set. Yeah. A lot of times. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I mean, we also have a union here. So if a director ever hits you, it's, uh, <laughs> that's not going to, yeah. that's not going to work too well for you. Um, but yeah, I would have loved to have talked to him like more in depth about his, his, his process of, of like, you know, he's, he's gone to, uh, he played real people, obviously Sanjay Dutt, uh, and and apparently he's in. He was at least at this time in the works to play Kishore Kumar, which would be amazing. I would love that film. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. And then the differences, obviously, between you know playing a real person and and when you should go with you know um, actually trying to imitate the artist as as opposed to what he did with Sanjay Dutt and kind of they did kind of more of a loose representation. Uh, of Dutt's character, um, and and all that kind of stuff. Obviously, the because he seems like he's he's even though he says he has nothing going on, I, you could tell he he's very thoughtful in his process. I, I'd imagine he knows what he he, he wants to do, and he, he he takes it seriously. Yeah, and he seemed to be more talkative when he was getting into questions that actually kind of kind of mattered. But a, a lot of the time, he'd be in like we never got to hear the PS on what his standard format is to reply to writing to somebody whose script he doesn't like uh, because as he right as he got to the PS one of the other guys jumped on what he said and made a joke and they laughed and they never brought it back to his PS yeah it don't, it don't, it, it, yeah I just format wise it was yeah not as good as the I'd rather I'd rather see someone talk I'd rather see someone talking to him about craft not as good as the Shah Rukh Khan one the Shah Rukh Khan one I remember liking a lot more uh yeah, and it may be because they they definitely carried themselves differently with Rambeer than they did with SRK. Yeah, maybe it's the senior thing that they were talking about with Rambeer, obviously. Maybe maybe it's obviously because he's probably closer to their age, maybe. Um, yeah. I did, I did find it interesting, though, the... Um, 
and then I forgot what I was saying. <laughs> and you call me old. <laughs> Hold on. It was it's it's there. It's somewhere. What was it? Uh God, I don't know why I can't remember what I was gonna say. That's funny. Um <laughs> Regardless, whatever I was going to say, I don't actually remember. Uh, I would love to actually sit down and, and, and chat with him. And this is not like a precursor. We're not about to interview Ren Beer. I wish we were. I, I really do wish we were about to interview Ren Beer. Yeah. Um, but yeah, because he seems like such a, a, a thoughtful person in, in, in what in his process and obviously bidding to talk about having an epic family that he has, getting like... The amount of mega stars in his family and talented people uh, is is extraordinary. Something I've never seen before. <laughs> With obviously now that we've learned, you know, Raj Kapoor it was uh, the, the the original one. Then Puck, the what is his name, Man Singh. You know his name. Yeah, that's Prithi Raj. Prithi Raj, his son, uh, Rishi, uh, and it, like there's just like an, a mountain of talent uh, and like the pressure that brings on you. Um, it's just, he, he, in my opinion, he would be such an interesting person to talk to. Very similar to Jim that we talked to. He seems like he's like more of a quiet person, but he's very thoughtful in his answers, I'd imagine. Yeah. Well, my AirPods are dying. Oh, well, what are you going to do? Anyways, let us know what the next video that we should react to, whether it's uh, another interview or uh, another Ren Beer thing. If you know Ren Beer, please send me his phone number uh, so I can. <laughs> don't don't actually. I'm not actually just gonna text him. But if you if anybody does know, because that's happened before. So it's like we've like wanted to get in contact with somebody, and somebody's like, "Hey, he's my cousin," or <laughs> whatever. Uh, Ren Beer, come on. We will talk to you about art, please. Just...